So I've been seeing lots of these videos showcasing how to make 2000s beats. It's been in my timeline for a minute now. I've mainly been seeing it from my boy Prod by Infinite. And recently I've just been sent this protocol drums pack, which has lots of Timbaland, Kanye, 2000s type drums and vibes, which I think it's perfect for a 2000s beat. So no talking, just get right into it. So real quick, this is the beat that I made, but I think I did a pretty good job on here. So I'm gonna just play the beat real quick. I really wanted a 50 cent vibe, but I know I didn't really achieve that here. I think I'm gonna make another video showcasing that, or at least like a Scott Scorch type of vibe. Been watching lots of Prod by Infinite tutorials, shout out him. So we're just gonna break it down real quick. So of course, we're just gonna start off with the chords. It's probably the most important thing of the whole beat. We're gonna be off in, a, we're gonna be in like in about an 80 to 100 BPM, mainly around 90 though, just go around 90. So for this chord right here, in reality, it's really simple. It's just a C minor triad right here. And all it is is just duplicated, boom, up. That's how it is. Same thing with here, but this goes down to A, D, G, and all I did was just bring these two up here. And it's the same for the four bars until right here. We got this final beat right here where, we, where it just goes down. It's literally just the same thing. Now it looks kind of confusing, but it's just like going down, you know, and it's doubled too. So it's just like, you know, these right here, you know, it's the same thing. It's just going down. So. Now these strings are from the Project Sam, which is a free orchestra bank. Um, it's on contact. It's probably one of the best string, uh, short strings I've ever heard in my life. Now this is the piano here. I wanted like a, you know, like a West Coast type of piano. So I just went with this right here. Pretty much a you know simple you know simple d to a to a or to a sharp then to a and i got the same thing here on the string hit which is on the flex plugin which is a free plugin all string staccato now the reason why this is short and not long is because i don't want it to be sustained because like look like it does not sound good compared to you know it being short Next up, we got some cymatic stems. Sometimes you need ideas, you know? Um, this is the clav. Now, I didn't want to cheat and use like, you know, the main components of this. I just wanted some accents, some things to like add to the background and textures. So I just went with this clav thing, which I just literally needed that stab right there. It's literally the same chord progression as well. It's just more low end, you know? These are three, this is the piano, the string, and the D, the clav. Then I added like a little accent here. This is from their Dubai version and it sounds like this. Now clearly I didn't want the rest of that. I just wanted that. That's all I wanted that. And so all I did was just literally made it short. That's literally all I did. Now next up we got the strings. It's also from the same um, loop, but this one's a string. Like that's fire but i just use this part right here i could use this all right next up i didn't really want to over complicate over complicate this in reality they really weren't using this many instruments they were just using like three instruments max four instruments max back then i, I try not to add too much to it other than besides like the hits which is like more tension now this someone with the piano again and i went with this midi Hey. Now, of course, all together without the drums. Now we got the bass here. I accidentally added the hi hats on it, so you're going to hear that. Now, this bass is from, of course, Flex, and it's from their five string bop bop ass bop bop bass picked and this one's from analog lab um it's the e ep pop preset from uh, i don't know where but it's from somewhere and last
lastly, all I did was just added a string to fill in the gaps and that's it. Alright, now lastly, we got the drums. Now these drums, like I mentioned in the, in the intro, they're very reminiscent of like Kanye, Timbaland, S1, just like 2000s era sounds, just like a whole bunch of uniqueness. Lots of like, lots of sounds that have a good amount of distortion, crunch, all that good stuff. They're all, they're all high quality. So the drums, you know, simple. They're pretty much simple, just like this. Now the best way to do that, you just go to advanced fill and just literally move it to the side a little bit. Boom. Oh yeah, see, you hear that? The loop points are on. You gotta make sure you turn them off. You got this, you got this hi-hat, this clean snare, crazy hi-hat. This one's probably my favorite snare, crunchy. This one's fire as well. Now with the bass, of course, I went with this pattern. I don't know if I showed you this, but it's just basic pattern. I mean, it's probably might be a little short video, but in reality, it's pretty much simple. You know, when it comes to thousand beats, you know, the less is more. Um, but a lot of it is just tension building. So like this right here, this, this, these two. These are just three tracks straight for just tension, which makes a lot of difference. Now, real quick, I do want to mention that drum kit also comes with a few samples. It also comes with drum breaks, which I actually used in another track. Let me just show you that real quick. Let me just show you this one. This is actually a pretty fire beat. So this is pretty simple. This is literally just a string and a bass note and I think a, a drum and a, and a violin. And that's literally a three instruments, not including the drums. Now, of course, this is from the Contact um, Project Sam free library, of course. And this is from Contact Solo Violin. And this is, of course, the Flex Brace. Now this drum loop that I was mentioning earlier is from here, which like all these drum loops are literally so fire. There's a lot of like, like Pharrell, Timbaland, Kanye, literally it's so crazy. But this is just the beat right here. And there's also a little switch up right here. So just check this out. That's essentially it, my boys. This kit is actually really, really creative. You know, a lot of Kanye, Timbaland, Scott Scorch type of stuff, especially with the uniqueness of sounds in here. Very, very reminiscent of 2000s type vibes. And as for the 2000s beats, you can just take what you know from West Coast and apply them to there. Just use more 2000s type sounds like strings, basses, violins, flutes, all that good jazz. But yeah, that's essentially it. If you guys have any suggestions, make sure you guys let me know in the comments. I might actually make a 50 cent type of beat but try to actually make it similar to Candy Shop, you know, the same vibe of it. But yeah, make sure you guys follow me on IG at IG underscore Swayflow, close to that 1,000 followers. Just hit 2,000 subs, which is absolutely crazy. Just try to hit 3,000 before the year ends. But yeah, essentially it. Hope you boys enjoy, and I'll see you boys in the next one. Deuce.